With Valentine's Day just over a week away, we are celebrating lots of love. But love, of course, can be spread in so many different ways, especially for those in our community in times of need. And someone who knows that firsthand is Sammy. Welcome into Studio 10. Hi. We are so happy to have you here. Now, uh, we just saw bacon cakes come in and show us all those delicious treats. And your mom is part of pouring all that love into the community at Bacon Cakes. Mm -hmm. But you also have a love for someone very special your husband Michael yes. who's recently gone through a very long and hard procedure mm -hmm. uh, talk us through some of the strength that you've seen through him um, so he was misdiagnosed um, with severe migraines for about seven years mm -hmm. um, and on December 16th he um, was found 45 miles away from home um, very confused didn't know where he was how he got there um, and they ended up actually doing extensive scans um, and found a um, meningioma brain tumor. Wow. Um, and they were able to get all of it out. He still has to do some radiation and stuff for the next few weeks and so. so um, but he's doing really good. Good. He's, he's moving forward and doing the best that he can. Yeah, I'm sure. And a very tough fun on you and your family yeah. through all of these highs and lots of lows during all of this confusion, information overload, um, but obviously lots of strength uh, between Michael and for you yeah. and, and your family. And as you mentioned, you know, he is doing really well. Doctors, you know, anticipate that he's going to make a full recovery, mm -hmm. but of course recovery mm -hmm. is it's easier said than done. It's going to be long and very time-consuming, I can imagine, right? Oh, yeah. Yep. It's going to be quite some time. He um, will, it'll take some time for him to go back to work and all of that. I had to take a leave of absence um, to care for him for 24-7, you know. Um, but he's doing marvelous. Yeah. So yeah. he's got lots of strength and he can definitely pull through it. That's, that's what we love to hear, especially, I feel like, too, you really do see that love. Not, I mean, I know it's, it's February and, you know, it's a time of love, but yeah. it, just, it just goes to show that, you know, you have to drop everything and yeah. be there for, for those loved ones. And yep. you see that right there. And to help out with medical expenses, uh, because I'm sure there's a ton. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, yes. um, there's going to be a great barbecue, mm -hmm. pulled pork benefit mm -hmm. event and dinner happening this Friday. Tell us all about that. So um, it's we're going to have pulled pork uh, sandwiches, um, potato salad, baked beans, um, dessert, and a drink. Mm -hmm. um, it'll be $15 a person. Um, Children five and under are, you know, free. Um, we'll have a silent auction and Ooh. a bake sale as well. Of course, bake, <laughs> bake of goods. Of course, of course. <laughs> um, and all the proceeds will go towards all of his medical bills and monthly bills that we need to take care of. Yeah. So. What a nice thing and very, very, it uh, sounds very good. If your stomach <laughs> isn't growing, I, I know it yeah, will definitely be I can't fulfilled wait. there. Mm -hmm. Yes. So talk a little bit about what would it mean for, you know, viewers at home or the mid-Michigan community to come in to that dinner on, on Friday. Sure. So it'll mean the world to us. Um, Michael is the person who would, you know, give anybody the shirt off of his back. Mm -hmm. um, so... It would be great to see everybody and meet new people yeah. and, you know, have lots of support for him because that's all he really needs right now. Yeah. Um, but we also have a GoFundMe page mm -hmm. um, and you can donate to that as well. Yeah. Um, and it'll, it, it's just going to make things so much easier Absolutely. for him. Absolutely. Absolutely. So. Well, we if there's one thing we know Mid Michigan does well, and that's support. So yes. uh, we are excited to support you and and your family. But thank you so much for stopping by and sharing your story. We wish all the well to, to Michael. But once again, it's all happening this Friday from six to eight over at the First United Methodist Church in Eaton Rapids. But thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you.